Good afternoon, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory. We're back to our La Mulana randomizer today. Uh, fourth session, we're about 14-ish hours in. Um, getting pretty close. Getting pretty close, I think, to finishing things off. We've got one boss left, Tiamat, in the uh, <clears throat> dimensional corridor there. Um, we're just missing a few other items to get to the true shrine of the mother and maybe some other items besides that to find those items. So uh, let, let's go ahead and, and get in on this here. So let's just take a quick peek, see folks. So I did write down some notes from last time. So we've got plenty of places we can go. For now though, we're gonna duck out of, sir, we're gonna duck out of uh, Dimensional Corridor <clears throat> because there's one item in Inferno Cavern. Where are you? There you are. Um, that I think we skipped over. So we're gonna go check that right quick. Oh, okay. Right here. Right here, right here, right here. Hopefully this is something that we actually need. Oh, well look at that, the woman statue. That is something we need. Uh, all right, you know what? Whilst we're outside um, of the dimensional corridor, let's kind of chase that one down. Uh, we need to go to Temple of the Sun first, I believe, with this thing. Because we need to change the woman statue into the maternity statue, and then we can do some other things with it. Um, but we need to go to Temple of the Sun first to do that. Uh, if I remember correctly, that's down below, I believe. Keep going, keep going down below way the heck down here. Uh, to the right, I believe? Uh, hmm. No, that's not where I expected it to be. Hey, CJ. How you doing? Good to see you. Um, shoot. Where was that? Okay, let me, let me look this up. <laughs> let me not dick around and just look up where this place is. I know it's in Temple of the Sun somewhere, but I just don't know where. All right, Temple of the Sun, the room, <clears throat> excuse me, the room I'm looking for is, oh, it's in the pyramid itself. Okay, good. Um, should be able to get in there. From here. And then one, one room over. Yeah, here we go, perfect. Um, I just need to wait for this. Turn from the woman statue into the maternity statue. I think it should play a little jingle when it actually happens. I don't know if I need to be standing in a specific spot for it to happen. I just need to wait. I just need to be patient. I hope. I just need to be patient. There we go. Oh, it even, even pulled. Alright, so with that then, we need to go into the Temple of the Moonlight. Thankfully we are like, literally right by the entrance to it. And into the correct section of it as well. We need to be in the Pyramid and Temple of the Moonlight. Oy. And we need to present the thing there opens that. That's nice. It's very handy. And then we need to fall asleep. So we just need to pause, wait for our dude to eat his curry, and, and have a snooze, and then that chest should open. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh, hey! It's the Jed Pillar! That is quite important. Good. We are one step closer to being where we need to be. All right. Well, since we do have the now maternity statue, we can go to one more place and use it. Uh, we need to go to... let's see... I think we need to get to... Chamber of Birth via... Graveyard. Oh, also we should try to refill our Lamp of Time at some point, because we're going to need that for one of the fights in Dimensional Corridor. Or not for the fight itself, rather, to get one of the items in Dimensional Corridor. Um, so I hope we're gonna be crossing paths with a, a lamp refill. Oh, actually, while we're here, too. Good, this is great. Doing so many things 
like right away. Uh, I need to, okay, not yet. I need to scan this little Dillabop. Since a long time ago, we got the, the picture scanning software and we totally ignored this thing. Is this gonna lead to another item, I think? Hey, that got us Miracle Witch. Oh, Miracle, ah, oh, we could have really used that a long time ago. Well, oh good, there's a, a lamp refill up here. Okay, very good. Let's get our lamp refill. Uh, I, I, there, I think there's one more scan spot we need to find. We did have one in Dimensional Corridor last time, which led us to, I believe, the Fairy Clothes, which is good. Um, but there's one more of those little picture scan spots we need to find. I don't remember where it is, so I'll look that up later. But for now, since we've got, we've still got the woman statue equipped, very good. Uh, I think we just need to go down a little bit and use it. <clears throat> oh, we also need to come back for that doorway down there. But not yet. Actually, I came to the wrong section of Chamber of Birth. We can just warp. We just need to warp to the right section here, and then I need to probably just follow this around a little bit. Yeah, because here's the other use point of this. There's that. What do we got here? Ah, uh, Caltrops. That's not terribly useful. It's useful for doing weird glitches and shit, but I don't know how to do those, so... I guess we're just not gonna worry about it. Uh, unfortunate. But... Uh, I know there's one... Did I already... Do the crystal skull here? I don't know if I did. It's glowing, which seems to suggest to me that we did, but I don't remember. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, hey. Map. We'll buy it. We'll buy a map. We've got plenty of money for it. We'll buy some more bombs too, I guess. And we'll, we'll buy any more bullets, though. They're rather expensive still. I must have already done this. Yeah, it's all glowy and shit. Okay. Uh, now, since we're in Chamber of Birth already, we can go fight Skanda. Skanda? Skanda? Whatever. Um, remember how to get there. <laughs> uh, okay. I think this will be our last trip into this section of Chamber of Birth. Well, actually, no, that's not true, because we need the, um, Oh, no! Now we have this, actually. Uh, the statue. Bonk. And then what? Okay, then the Key of Eternity, I think. Yeah, there we go. And then that does that, and we're gonna need to... probably warp out since we're in soft lock. Okay. But alright, so that unlocks that. Can I get back there without doing anything weird. Uh, well, I'm gonna see where this takes This might actually take us to Skanda first, which is fine. Uh, maybe. <laughs> heck am I? Uh, where the heck am I? This might be sort of on the right path. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, no, this isn't the right path. We need to kind of go around again. Shoot. Okay, that's that's fine. But then I guess on the way we can grab that other chest, and since we've got the Milan and Talisman, the curse on it won't be a problem. I hope. Uh, wait, I need to go down this way. I think. Oh no, that was for the serpent staff bit. Eh, I do need to go up and around. Mm, how are we doing on weights? We've got eight lines. Probably pop into a store and get one at some point. 
Uh, how the hell am I going to get that thing? I think I need to come from the other side, huh? Right, this dude would stop firing weird energy spears, I think. Be real nice. Yeah, okay. Uh, how the hell do I get that thing? Now I'm not sure. Oh, please. God damn it. Uh, okay, yeah, I remember this section being a little bit painful. Alright. weights sooner rather than later, but it's pretty easy to warp out. I think the surface has a shop with weights in it. Uh, okay, no, that wasn't what I was expecting. Shit. Alright, well, whatever. Everything's dead. We can easily jump back over there. <laughs> Alright, well, let's just make our way through. I'm pretty sure eventually we'll get back over there. Oh, no, I took the wrong path. Damn it. Yeah, because this just takes me back up and around. Can I, uh... Oop, I don't want, don't want to do that. Alright, alright, just flips me back here. That's good. Yeah, I wanted to jump up in that other thing first. Right, because we had the chakrams and we needed to do the thing. Okay. Uh, I think this is right. Burn two weights to get through here. Hope I'll have enough health to deal with. Scanned it here. being particularly problematic. Oh, well. I say that as I get my butt kicked. Uh, since I can't shield against him, let's try some chakrams. Mm -hmm. Ah, buddy. Is that it? Ah, oh, no, he just kind of did a little, little Pepsi Man pose there. Crap. Don't want to lose this. Shit. Might lose that. Yeah. Ooh, might die. <laughs> that and a very well-timed refill. And what do we got here? Uh, the waterproof case. Damn it. Well, that was worthless. Uh, where the heck does this door go, though? And also, how do I get to this other chest over here? Let me look up the layout for this again. Uh, where are we? Chamber of Birth, right? Uh, Crystal Skull, Kong of the Soul, yada 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 yada, Dance of Life, etc. etc. There's also a coin chest in H4. Where the heck is H4? Oh, that's in the other section that we might need to go back to. Shit. Alright. 
That's fine, I guess. How do I get this other chest that's in the wall at D5, it looks like? Just open that. Use the Eternity and Dragon Bone on the right, and then jump into the pit. Use the key of Eternity, and while blocking X, the chest can only be broken by attacking the lower left wall on E5. Lower left wall on E5. Lower left wall on E5. Oh, really? How the heck do I get back there now? Uh... Hmm. We need to warp back and go around again. But that should be the last... Maybe the second last item here, because there's that one coin chest in the other half of the place that we need to get to. around here. Uh, is that going to put me in the right spot? How did I get down there before? Oh, right, because I think I cycled around in the opposite direction. Yeah, so then I need to go here, I think. No, because this will just cycle me around again. Shit, how the hell did I get to... Okay. I need to get down there somehow, but I don't remember which warp does it. that's going to do it either. Two more to get through there. I just need to get down there. How the hell do I get down there? I need to do it from here anyways. Shoot! Okay. E5. But how do I get to E5? roaming around until I find this particular warp. So it was an earlier warp from a previous day, but now I don't quite remember. It's here. Oh, maybe, it, yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, alright. I think I just need to fall down the center. Yeah, because then that gets me to this other section, which was accessible before that block started moving in the screen above, right? I think there's a warp on this side. I'm hoping this warp takes me to where I need to go. It sort of does. <laughs> Uh, and then go through here? No. Shit. This takes me back here. Crap, I need to get down there. We're not down here. I need to get down to the other section. I'm running out of weights to do this. warp on the other side. Just back? Do I just backtrack? No. Can't do that. Look for any... I'm gonna look for any, like, other opposite-facing warps to get me through there, but... 
Maybe I need to come in from the other section? That actually could be. I sh should probably warp out, get some more weights, and then come back for this anyways. Alright, uh, I'm gonna hope that the surface shops have weights. I think they do. At least one of them should. Good. Okay. Just buy a whole bunch since they're extremely cheap. Alright, that should suit us just fine. Alright, now we need to get back to Chamber of Birth via... Uh, graveyard. Check that last item. Or, hmm. If this goes to the other section of Chamber of Birth, we might be able to check that other chest as well. Not the one we've been angling for, but the other, other one. I'm gonna hope that this uh, takes us to the right spot. Warps that might take us there. Probably not. I think it needs to be a warp on the left side. Hey, well, we'll see what this does. Just need to be on the lookout for a white wall. Which might have been here, come to think of it. Uh, destroy the white wall in the lower left of this room, H4. Are we in H4 right now? We are not. I think it's one room below. Hmm. This doesn't look familiar. It's because it's not the right... Okay, right, right. So write one more column and then... And then drop down. And it looks like that was the lower left chest, is the one we were thinking of. So that's a bust. And I didn't find the warp I was looking for here either, so that's also a bust. Oh, but here's one here. Mm, no, that's not the one I was looking for. This is just going to lead me up and around, but we'll try that warp up there. Maybe that'll take me there. Nope, that just takes me inside. What about this one? Nope, that takes me back out. <laughs> I think the one inside there takes me to the other central area in Chamber of Extinction, which we don't want to go to. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that's not where we want to go then. Alright, let's make the rounds again. Warp's there. See, there's a warp on the left there? Would that do it? Does that do it? Just gonna check it. One of the ones that fucked me up in my original playthrough. Just trying to figure out where each. Oh, well, damn it. It's not gonna do it. They do. Right. Instead of climbing down. Okay. Uh, pretty sure this one won't do it, but we'll, we'll give it a try. Oh no! Yeah, son of a bitch, there it is. Okay. Okay. Need to make sure I have the talisman equipped. Wait, what the hell? Why didn't that open up? Should that not have opened up? Or maybe it busted the wall from the other side. Uh, crap. Okay, so now we need to cycle around it one more time. actually open for me. Should at least 
be able to see it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Can we make that jump just barely? Alright. Uh, oh, it's just another normal ass map. Damn it, we're. That's not the map we needed. We do still need one more. The map to the Shrine of the Mother, but. Mm, it's not exactly the one we're looking for. Okay, so that's the other one that I was thinking of in Chamber of Birth. Scanda, we did. We can light up the Chamber. No, we can't light up Chamber of Extinction without the flares. So I guess we're going to go back to Dimensional Corridor now, uh, since we do have... Well, before we do that, let's take a quick top off on the surface. We did grab... We did refill our Lamp of Time, so that's going to help... Oh, uh, yeah, I should see. It's going to help with that one boss fight that we were struggling with last time, or at least to get the item above the boss fight. It's going to be a fun little jaunt. So in order to get to Shrine of the Mother, or to open up Shrine of the Mother a little bit more, we still need the... Oh wait, it says we've got three or four now. Wait, what the hell? Do we actually pick up the right one? Um, look at software ones. No, we're still missing the other... The other map. Still missing the other map software. But maybe we picked up the shrine map in there somewhere? We must have, because we got the Dragon Bone, we've got one of the map software things. I guess we must have picked up the picked up the shrine map at some point. And that's good. That's what we need, but I don't know that we have everything yet. We're still missing one kind of key component of this. Uh alright, so let's go back to Dimensional Corridor then. We'll finish up there at the very least. Try and finish up there. Oh, but there's also another thing here we need to take care of, too. Oh, God. There's four rooms we need to do certain things in. Should be able to do some of them on our way back up. Finding Mishisu. A4, D5, C4, D3. So this will give us the... I don't know if it'll give us the birth and death mantras just yet. But it will reveal the 12th sub-boss, which we need to find anyways. So A4... What was it again? A4, D5, C4, D3. A4 is sort of on the way. Yeah, A4 will just be over here. Oh wait, those are... Did we already get the birth and death mantras? We must have, huh? Uh, let me turn off... Actually, we need mantra on here. Can't, of course. Uh, let's turn off snapshots and turn on mantra and see what we got. We do have birth and death. Oh, okay. thought we hadn't gotten those yet. But alright, that's... that's good. For now. I'm not gonna use them just yet. So let's turn the snapshots thing back on. Alright, uh, so I believe we're in A4. Yep. In front of the statue in the middle of the room. There's no statue in the middle of the room here. Am I in the right room? I am not in the right room. Oh, I have to go up one more. Really? Okay. Or an A5. Ah, yeah, there's a statue. Okay, and we'll do the, the little glowy bits, and then next one was. Uh, D5. Over, let's see, one, two, three, and down one. Mm. 
Okay, I think this is D5, in the middle of the room. Oh no, this isn't D5. Over one more and down one more. Okay, there we go. D5 and then C4. Uh, in front of the statue in the middle of the room, which is this. And then D3. C3. There's D3. In front of the glowing spider. There we go. Doo doop doop doop, and then that unlocks that, I guess, so then we can fight Mushusu. Hope we win, because <laughs> I don't want to redo that sequence. Oh, oh, okay. clothes and all that. Oh, ouch. Avoid Giganto Beam of Death. He doesn't do any more of the fire. There we go. Perfect. Do doop a doop a doop. And oh, there's another chest too. What do we got there? A diary. I don't know that that's important anymore. So that would have normally come before the talisman, and before we go talk to the Elder again, but we've already got the talisman. I don't think that's terribly critical, but that is one more. I'm gonna go save, because <laughs> I don't want to do this again. It's a very convenient refill there, too, so that's nice. Unfortunately, warp back until we clear this field entirely. But it's not too far away, so we'll just do this. Okay. Now, let's get our lamp time ready. Let's go face this last a hole up here, and hope we get a favorable enough pattern that we can get the item in the room above pretty quickly. Even though we could go back for it after... I could go back for it after the fact, but I think that involves a, a pretty weird damage boost that I don't want to have to do. Okay, so here we are. Uh, please, if you could... Fire weird waterfall thing over on the right hand side. Please. There we go. Yeah, I'm still gonna fuck this up, aren't I? Because water physics are the worst! And if I fuck it up, I'm just gonna restart because, uh, yeah, I don't wanna go through all that garbage again. Uh, God, even with the lamp of time, that's a really tough thing to do. physics. There we go. Jeez. Alright, well now we just need to do this. <laughs> Which is going to be problematic in and of itself, but we 
should be able to, I think, de-boost there, down the spikes. Oops. Carefully jump onto that pot, jump onto this thing. Uh... Yeah... <laughs> oh, here's what I have to do. I'm gonna de-boost there so we can do that. Okay, and then carefully, boom. What do we get? Ah, more health. Uh, you know what? That's pretty important, actually. Uh, I'll take that. I'll take that in exchange. <laughs> but, if we do have to reset out of this anyways, I probably wouldn't go back to that, because that is just a gigantic pain in the ass to get to. Uh, can we... Can slip... Can we slip out without him, uh, damn. <laughs> I was kind of hoping we could get away from that, but... I'm trying to think of the best way to deal with this fucker now, because... Ugh, oh, he's just out of range. I hate it. That dude. Ah, oh, I hate that his attack goes through walls. That is kind of stupid. Ow. There's no safe spot for that, huh? Okay. Swap sides. Okay. To play this a little safe because I think one more hit and I'm toast. There. Oof. Okay, well, that's, um, all the sub-bosses. Can we warp out of here yet? We can't. Alright. So, now we could go fight Tia. Go fight Tiamat here, which we are going to do, but I need health. <laughs> I need health before I even think about going into that fight. So we're gonna quickly run away, head back to the surface, get some more health, and and go for this fight. Because this will be the last boss we need to do uh, before we get to the actual final boss. Which we can't get to without a few other items like the Medicine of the Mind and uh, revealing the True Shrine of the Mother, which we can't do without one of the software things. Actually, we might be able to do it. We'll have to check into that. Maybe we can get the True Shrine, true shrine without uh, that last software thing. Uh, surface. Where am I going to surface? Okay. Getting closer, though. Like, finding the, the Jed Pillar right away there really helps us out. Because now, after we beat Tiamat, we've got a few places in Tower of Ruin we can hit now. As well as the passage between... Uh, Chamber of Extinction and Tower of Ruin. And Surface. It's going to be a bit of running around. But that's all right. So we can go ahead and close this thing about Mushusu. We're done there. Now we can go back to the corridor one more time. Uh, actually, while we're here, is there any, any point chests that we need to be worried about? Uh... B6. Break the wall in the upper right corner of B6. Where is B6? Okay, it's just over to the left. Let's check that real quick. I don't remember if we got that one while we were there the first time. Is this B6? No, this is A6. Oh. Over one. And, oh, it's at the bottom. I think we did get this one. 
Upper right corner. Yeah, there it is. Okay, never mind. So, if I recall, the Tiamat fight isn't too bad, especially given our <clears throat> given our health and weaponry. It shouldn't be too terribly difficult, I hope. Um, but we're, we'll, just, we'll just have to see, I guess. Since we know. We mostly remember the patterns here, but I, I think I can just stand down below, right? Uh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, maybe. Okay, uh, let's get our shield out. Let's see? This needs to be at, okay, we can get two shots. Maybe. <laughs> okay, there's phase one. I think phase two opens with the uh, death from above. Oh, ouch. Uh, I, do I still need to do this? I do. Okay. Just got more lasers. More lasers and we might be able to just tank all the damage we need to tank. Ouch, excuse me. Oh, alright, so now it's death from above. Oh, and I still got hit by that? Excuse me. Remember if there was a phase three, which almost certainly means there's a phase three. Okay, stay towards the middle though, I don't want to get caught on the outside. Yeah, there's definitely a phase three. <laughs> because of course there is. All right. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna hang out to the left here. Oh, and then there's uh, lots of lasers. Yep, I think I might die here. Ah, shit. Oh, I think I can use Caltrops to damage boost through them. That That's the thing. That's the thing I didn't use in my first playthrough. And I only figured that out later, so, uh, okay. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. He did not get hit by the death from above thing, because that was like, what, 100 damage? Ridiculous amount, whatever it was. I'm just gonna be a big old coward, hang on the extreme edges so I don't get hit by anything. Oh, and that still hit me. That was almost 100 damage. Goodness. Okay, uh, Caltrops, Caltrops, Caltrops. Oh, and I didn't fucking <laughs> totally whiffed on it, too. I had him out in time, but I just didn't, uh... Just did not do the appropriate thing. In the appropriate direction. There we go. Easy peasy. Second try. Close enough to the first try. Alright, well, there's the final boss. <laughs> Well, the, the final regular boss before the final boss. But unfortunately, that doesn't give me any more items, I don't think. 
Besides a cursed coin chest. Oh boy, thanks for that. I guess we'll just get it since we're here. Okay. So there's that. Uh, let me take a quick spin through this area one more time before I leave. We got that. I think we got that. We got that, definitely. I think we got that. And we did the scan here as well. So I think Dimensional Corridor is finished. So, now we can go to Chamber of Birth by a graveyard. Uh, this graveyard? There it is. Okay. Um, we need a charge of lamp time. Okay, we should probably just refill lamp while we're here, too. Let's just take a couple second detour at some point. Where was it? It was on the right somewhere, I believe, right? Is it up above or was it further to the right? I think it was further. Yeah, okay, perfect. Nice wizards. Dealt with enough snow today, come on. <laughs> oh, 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 careful. There we go. All right, so now we're good to go back to Chamber of Birth. We'll take the backside door over Chamber of Extinction, which I believe will be the... <clears throat> It should be the path back to the surface, which should take us to the other top side half of Tower of Ruin. And then that should get us to the other part of Tower of Ruin we couldn't get to before. Uh, un that's curious. Was there always an Ankh thing up there? I feel like that's a fake out. That's a fake out for something. But I don't remember what. <laughs> and I don't remember if that will be fatal if we go for it. I guess we'll go for it. Oh, hey, you have the, one of the other monster tablets. Not that it matters terribly. There might have been... Oh, I think this is going to be an instant death thing, isn't there? Yep. Okay. <laughs> I was like, yeah, there was definitely a thing to do with that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nice try. Nice try, Lamalana. You almost got me. I did remember, sort of. Uh, don't we have the Magatama, do we? Damn it. It's one of two items we're missing. It's the other one we're missing. What's the other use item we're missing? Hmm. I think it shows on my tracker, does it? Huh. No, I guess not. Oh, shit. Okay, yeah, that's right. These dudes. Shouldn't be a problem. Got plenty of health to deal with this. Oh, ouch. Except for that. And that. Ow, oh, sir. Stop it. Shit, one of you. That's just you and me, skinny. Yeah. You better back off. Ah. Okay. There. Uh, so if we had the Megatama, we could use it there, but we don't have it. Alright, so now we need to get up there. Wake up, idiot. There we go. Thank you. Zzz. Ouch. Ooh, that, that still caused some damage, doesn't it? Let's walk over a little bit more, buddy. A little bit more. That'll probably do. Oh, ooh. Okay. Ah, sorry. Okay, should take us up to the surface, and I 
one of these. One of these was an openable wall. Oh, right there. But it needs to be bombs, I think. Oh, well, fucking... Here. Just roll along. Thank you. What we got here? A smolder. Oh, it gives our primary weapons a, a boost, I guess. Woohoo. Uh, but that's not terribly exciting. I feel like there was one other thing along this path, too, but maybe not. Uh, it might have been the last error. Oops, it's the wrong box. It might have been the last thing at the surface here. Uh, Source of the waterfall we got, life seal we did, and the pyramid shortcut which we just did. Okay, I think that's the last one. This should take us to Tower of Ruin now, right? Oh, Inferno Cavern. Oh, right. Oh, there's the last map thing! Hooray! Fucking did it. Amazing. Oh. Uh, okay. That. Really? Oh. Uh, please, please. No! <laughs> oh. Alright, I don't remember what that does, though. I heard something clunk to the right, I believe. Here's... Come on. Uh... Actually, I don't know what that did. This is the Infernal Cavern, yeah? Uh, B1. What did that do? Any damage, yada yada, I know that. Place to wait on the days behind the landing stage, it'll vanish the next time you enter, revealing the mon- Oh. Oh. It's just for a magic tablet. Shoot. Uh, not exactly what I was going for. Oh. No. Oh. Fuck. Uh, I might die here. <laughs> yep, I'm gonna die there. Uh, so... Can we get back here easily? I don't think so. We need to do the entire thing again. But I don't want to die and lose all that stuff, so... I'm gonna... Coward out and go refill. Oh, also we should go talk to What's-His-Nuts again. I don't think this is gonna give us anything more. But I don't remember if we need to talk to him again. I think it's just... Oh, I... what did I just get there? Oh, that was the last Ankh gem that we needed. Perfect. Good, I was really wondering where the fuck that was going to be. <laughs> Alright, cool. We're one more step closer. Uh... I do still need the medicine in the mind, though, so we do need to do that shortcut again. Ah, nuts. Alright, well, this is good. This is good. We're nearly there. We're nearly there. Uh, good, because I was afraid we might have had to start looking at the item spoiler list. To be like, where the fuck is this last little thingamadig we need? But we should be good now. So once we get through that shortcut again... Graveyard, to Chamber of Birth, to Chamber of Extinction, to Surface, to Inferno Cavern, to Top of Tower of Ruin. Um, that should be it, really. Uh, so let's go... Graveyard, right? Oh, start of this big, long-ass chain. Right, let's do an action save there, too. So, we might not need to hunt down that last... <clears throat> that last snapshot mural thing, we might not need the light up Chamber of Extinction, which means Flare Gun is no longer really necessary. 
It re I really should have found it by now, I would have thought, though. Because I don't think... I don't think this rando is cruel enough to require me to do Chamber of Extinction in the dark, which I did anyways. Mostly without a map. But, you know, maybe maybe we look up where the flare gun is. <laughs> and be like, hey, where the fuck should I have gotten this, like, ten hours ago? This Magatama might not be necessary either. Spalder would have been real helpful for the boss fights, but too late for that now. They still help in the final boss fight. Wake up, idiot. Thank you. Oh, well, next for that, I guess. Okay. One more loop around. So interesting. Okay, so we did need to go back to the Elder twice. Once for the uh, Talisman, which we got super early, and then once again for the Diary, which we just got like 20 minutes ago. That's, that's good to know. That's good to know. I wasn't sure if that was going to be a thing. Oh. Yeah, let's boost the rest of them. Oh. Crap. <laughs> short hops. Oh, short hops. <laughs> Nuts. Uh, crap. That's not gonna do it. Oh, I did. Interesting. Okay, so here we are at the top of the Tower of Ruin. Uh, okay, there's a seal over here, and I think there's a seal on the other side. So Skyfish are in here, too. That sucks. Please don't knock me down that pit. That would be unfortunate for me. Okay, I think as long as it opens up that ladder, we should be okay. Do we even need to fight Nua? Can I even fight Nua? Uh, how do I activate this fight? Uh, we're in Tower of Ruin now. <sighs> how do I even get there? E1, of course. Oh, I should probably actually go down the ladder first. Since we did just unlock this and all. I don't... Is there another Grail tablet up here? Oh, excuse me. Okay, good. This puts this ladder here. I... Now I'm going to need to do this, actually, since we have the things. Uh, let's take root, Mantra. Death. Are these two? Yeah, because there's a thing there. There's the statue. Wait, how the heck do I even... How the heck do I even get... Oh, I'd have to drop down from above. But where does that path lead to? Hmm. Well, first things first. Death to you. And also death to you. And then... Birth to you, because you're harmless. So, that should get me the medicine of the mind, I think. And if that's the case, uh, we might be good to finish this off. I'd really like to find a way to get over there without dropping down from above. So maybe we don't even need to fight Nua. Like I don't, I don't even want to deal with it. 
I don't even want to deal with it. You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go grab medicine in the mine and get out of here. So I think we've got everything we need. Anyways. Skull. Vessel. Medicine in the mine. Hoorah. That should be the last thing. Ah, that just opens that. Very good. Well, now I'm real curious, though, what this, uh, where this passage leads. Because we could have been here a lot sooner. Oh, Tower of the Goddess? Really? Ugh. Yeah, we could have been there a lot sooner. Or at least that part of it. Uh, which means we could have gotten the medicine a lot sooner, too. Mm. Alright, well... I think we've got a warp point to Shrine of the Mother somewhere, right? Oh, it that warp point might have gone away now, actually. Yeah, how do we get back there? <laughs> Since now it's probably true shrine. So we've got all the things, right? There's one from Twin Labs, Endless Corridor, Chamber of Extinction, really. Oh, two from Endless Cold War. Interesting. Uh... Yeah, so which one do we want to... Oh, except before we do this, we should go make sure that the Fairy Queen is going to be helping us. I think she is, but let's just double check. When the time comes. What do you mean when the time comes? I don't know if that means what I think it means, but let's go ahead and save it again. Uh, Alright, so, Endless Corridor, right? B5. Okay. We'll see where that one leads us. I don't know that it's going to be accessible through here, but it should be pretty easy to get to. Yeah, because I do remember there being a ladder? On the far right, perhaps. Probably just could have gone to the left. Yeah, okay. So there's a ladder, I think, after we talked to one of the philosophers. This ladder appeared. Uh... Yeah, so it's the true shrine now. Um... So why... <laughs> So, um, why did the Fairy Queen be like, oh no, come come back and see me when the time is right? So we didn't really need this, it's just money. It's maxed out. So where the hell does this door go to, then? Oh, Jeebus. Um, well, that doesn't help me. Oh, I see. Okay. I think that's an extra door that the rando throws in to get back to your original Shrine of the Mother. Which doesn't really do us any good now, actually, because we couldn't... We weren't able to remove the, the skull walls. So, okay, we might be... We might be just be good to go. Um, let's pick a different entrance, though. Twin Labs, Endless Corridor E2, goes to F3. Where are we at right now? Oh, we're at F3 right now, aren't we? That looks like F3. Oh, that was E2, yeah, yeah. Uh, so Endless Corridor goes to C1, which looks like the one we have to go to. <laughs> ah, shit. Okay, one more trek through uh, Endless Corridor, I guess. I guess we're in pretty good shape here. We're only missing one 
health up. We've got pretty much all of everything else. Just grab this fairy just in case, huh? A little bit of extra. A little bit of extra safety for something. Alright, wait a minute. Hold on. Let me make sure. Let's see. Let's see. Where's the other one? E2. Okay, so it won't be too far off. are real weird sometimes. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to go... Oh, right, it's gonna be under Weird Eyeball Dude that we fought a long time ago. Time charge that. Mm, I don't know if we want to hang on to that. So we can use the lamp of time to skip Beelzebub. I don't remember if he was a problem or not. Okay, so here we go. Um, yeah, they did put extra doors in here to get back to normal shrine. Uh, not sure we want to do that. Oh, that was a bad refill. Um, Yeah, because now the tablet is all the way down. Oh, excuse me. Uh, nice, nice for that. Really want to get to the tablets. So I'm actually kind of surprised that some of this... is kind of cleared out for us. Like, I wouldn't have expected... Excuse me. Wouldn't have, wouldn't have expected that chest to have been opened, but maybe we sounded good. Maybe we got that already in the non-true shrine. Uh, thought I heard a thump over to the right. Oh, it opened this part. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Use a little more contrast there to figure that out. Oh, and then we climb up this. Thing I'm not sure about here. Do we need to go down to the left? Uh, looks like we probably should. But we'll see what's over here first. Just yes, Oh, nothing but spikes. Great. Ouch. Tablet will be right before Bale's above, so we could. Nice. Chakram. Uh, we could. Just kind of murder him and then warp out and refill. Or warp out, refill, then murder him, then warp out again, and refill. And we might need to warp out again, anyways, to go talk to the Fairy Queen one more time. Because if now isn't the right time, like. When? <laughs> when is it supposed to be? Uh, okay. 
Okay, yeah, there's the tablet over there that the fairies need to take care of. Um, do we... I wonder if we do need to warp out and talk to her, actually. I guess if it doesn't move out of, or if they don't get it out of my way for me, I will have to go talk to them anyways. Side doors, right? <laughs> okay, here's the. Uh, I'm not gonna risk this. Sorry, buddy. I don't wanna. Don't wanna deal with you on the way to the tablets. <laughs> Thank you. Excellent. I thought it was going to be the other way around, that the tablet was before Beelzebub, but looks like that's not the case. Uh, keep going to the left. Ow. Circumspect this path was. So now I think we can go talk to the fairy queen. And she'll be like, oh, a big tablet? We'll take care of that for you. I'll be like, thanks. Thanks. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Well, before we do that, though, we'll top off one more time. all missing here. I think we're only missing the heatproof case, which we found in a shop but didn't buy, and the Hermes boots for items. And then the usable items, we're missing the Magatama and... I don't know what that last one is. And a pair of sub-weapons, the Shuriken and the... and the Flare Gun, of course, yeah. Got all the main weapons. Yeah, I don't know what other usable item we're missing. Treasures. Oh no, the pepper. We're missing the pepper as well. Apparently that's not important this time. But hey, that's alright. I'm going in with nearly... Gonna be going in with nearly full health. And kit it out pretty good. I don't know that Lamp of Time is going to help us now. I, I doubt any of the of the forms of Mother are s susceptible to Lamp of Time. Uh, so we're probably pretty good here. Dummy hits here, it's especially good. I 
really in range for a convenient refill. There we go. Get rid of that. That should be the ladder up to the boss, I think, right? And... Well, or closer to it, rather. Yeah, there we go. Oof. Okay, well, here we are. At mostly full health. See how many of these forms I remember. Probably not any of them. Oh, yep. Including not even this one. <laughs> so there's the medicine of the mind and the grail. Probably a retry heavy fight, because I don't remember any of this. <laughs> I oh, what am I to do here? I mean okay, I've only got three chakras on. on the way back. Ah. It's gonna take a little bit. Because I don't know that I... Can I jump high enough to... Oh, there. Okay. I guess I can. Alright, well that was a lot of hits to be taking on the first form. Uh, oh boy. Yeah, no, this is gonna be a, a small problem, I think. Ouch. Which part of this am I supposed to be hitting? <laughs> or I'm supposed to be using something here, right? Uh, Eternity statue. Uh, crystal skull. I have to look this up again because I don't remember this fight for anything. Oh no, it's just the just the head. Oh, and that's probably dead. Yep, okay. Alright, well. Not unexpected. Missing, missing that particular software that would improve the damage of my whip, unfortunately. So, womp. Well, no matter. No, like what part? What part I can hit <laughs> without taking a dumb hit like that. swing of the axe is enough? Probably if I caught the sine wave pattern properly, huh? Ah, there we go. It's not bad. Although, uh, axe might be better here as well. 
no, 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 alright, well. Water physics, great. <laughs> Tana might be good for this one to hit below me, right? Uh, well, it would really help if I didn't have to deal with these fucking water physics. It would really help. Oh, why are they so bad? Just stupid bad. And now I'm down to four health, so that's gonna go about as well as expected now. Um, which one is this? <laughs> it's just the one that gains different powers depending on which cycle of the fight you're on, I think. There's no way in the heck I'm doing with this four health, but. At least confirm what we're doing here. Yeah, yeah, it is. Okay. Uh, that's Amphispina, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, does it restart me from the entire. Yeah, it does. Damn it. Hmm. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Yeah, it's got perfect cycle that I can't quite reach it. Uh okay. Oh what the hell? Yeah, good. Yep, another free hit for you. Good. Come on. I don't think. Do I have the thing that increases my iframes? I don't think I have that, do I? So why would I want to have something beneficial to me equipped for this? Oh, this fight sucks. This fight sucks so much. There we go. Well, I don't know how good that's gonna. Come on, you're not gonna let me go get that, are you? Oh, it's early. <sighs> Die here, probably. Yep. Z um. All right. What's the thing that gets me the better iframes? <laughs> Do I have it? Do I have it? After taking damage, death V. I don't think I have that one. But we'll check. Uh, nope, that is one of the four I'm missing. Go figure. <sighs> move and ran C. I've got ran C, but I don't have move. Do I have ran C and Mercury? Uh, I do. Hey, we can actually make something out of this then. Uh, let's get that right. Oh wow, that is quite pricey to put on. 
Alright, let's take that off. So at least this will get... Jeez, huh? I don't need reader anymore. But at least that'll get me more um, damage on the axe. Which might be more valuable to use here now. It's probably still faster for this part. Okay, good. 42 health we didn't need there, I guess. <clears throat> okay, uh, I think axe for the duration, right? So fucking perfectly timed and positioned to avoid goddamn hits. Yeah, all right, good. Better. Still not super good. Um, I don't know that shield is gonna help us here. Ooh, spicy. reasonable. Uh, no, I don't know that. God, come on. Their hitbox is so dumb. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, cool, thanks. No fucking recourse on that one. series of fights with 57 that uh, might get me one hit <laughs> at best uh, it's gonna be Sakit which I'm not sure what his deal was oh I don't remember that attack clearly oh okay might have been a bath in that one uh, I don't remember what that one's from. Ah, damn it. Hmm, nine health now. <laughs> Isn't looking great. Ah, yep. <laughs> that was better, though. Hmm. I think I need to rearrange my software again, yep. Everything, really. Uh, do, 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 do. What was it? Ran C and Mercury. Okay. Let me not do that. Alright, just get the quick save on it again so I don't have to re constantly rearrange it. Very good. Uh, I can't actual save here though. Alright, so I think the whip was still the still the thing. Oops, save. I'll use my gun there. What was still the thing to do here? 
might have better damage output just for its speed. I guess I need the axe for the, the hitbox. Wiggle it does. Oh my god. Alright. Okay. Let's not throw the chakram like I told you to, huh? Take a hit. I'm just gonna hit you. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Phase is okay as long as I don't get caught out by the zippy zaps. Or the sword rain or the laser beam. Like, come on. Oh, get out of here, really? I don't, how am I supposed to avoid that? Like, that's ridiculous. Okay, not bad. Not great, but not bad. Uh. I took two hits from that for some reason. Super cool. Actually, now would probably be the time to unload the old bulletos. What the hell? What hitbox was that? Okay. Mm. Mm. Whatever, it's fine. Okay, excuse me. Bitch. Yeah, it's gonna do weird ass curvy shit that I can't fucking get around. Great. Come on. Uh, <laughs> uh, fucking days. I hate it. Can you please? Of 
Yep. Yeah. Oh, yes. Alright, well, great fucking start. Uh, okay, it wasn't even close to that, but thanks. Yeah, of course. Yeah, let's jump right in the middle of that. do about that. Yep, all about the course. Actually, maybe the sub weapons are the way to go here. Oh, and it doesn't do any fucking damage to him. Like, that's great. Well, that's something. Oh, come on! Fucking... It's mm, irritating. <sighs> okay, it's fine, I guess. Gotta get one in there, don't you? Gotta get one. Nice, okay, that was perfect. Found the spot right away. Managed to do a thing. best we've done so far. Oh wow, we're still kind of floaty, aren't we? For some reason. Uh, I would actually like to land. <laughs> Can I please land? This seems kind of, uh, uh, yeah, well now I'm pretty much toast because I can't, oh well, I still got iframes. That's weird. Pretty sure that's not, uh, supposed to happen. <laughs> I would love to land so I can do things here, please. Eh? Uh, am I just soft locked here? Excuse me? Wow. Alright. That fucking sucks. Wow. Thanks, Mamalana. Well, son of a bitch, that was actually a pretty good go of things. So we did second phase perfectly. And third phase wasn't too terrible. Of 
course, you're gonna go left now. Right, whatever. It'd be a little bit easier if I had the Hermes boots. I really would. That's good positioning. Ah, get one on me, huh? Dude, fuck's sake. Still. Shield does anything, but I guess we'll kind of hang on to it. Oh, that's gonna burn me. Oh, no. Uh, what? The fucking normal ass teardrops can hit me? Okay, well, I don't, I don't know how to avoid that. It's just kind of stupid. Okay, bad. could appear so I can hit you please thank you okay um I think I want to land though this time please all right it's serviceable 101 isn't great health Okay, I was about to say, does it have contact damage when it goes into this phase? I guess it does. That sucks. <laughs> Ouch! Come on! Break. Okay, like, I jumped specifically to avoid that. Fair attack. Oh, that's Death Beam, and I'm probably dead. Oh no, amazing. Uh, amazing. Oh, that missed? Get out of here. Just go fuck yourself. Alright, Death Beam. Oh, okay. Overhead, yeah. Uh, it's exploding. How did that hit me? There was. Fucking hitboxes. Alright, cool. Well, it's just like the first time I played this, just fucking smash my face into it until I succeed, I guess. literally the last thing we have to do so well I guess technically not but <laughs> until we get to the actual last thing we have to do this is the last thing we have to do of course nope Easy. No need to rush this, I guess. Maybe I'm just being a little impatient. Uh, 
Uh, that count? That amazing. All right. Uh, gun X. One ninety one is pretty solid. Probably fuck it up anyways, but nice to know we can get this far without taking too much damage. Such a dumb attack, but come on. It's gonna be death beam probably, no? We got one more. I, even, I was even ahead of the curve on that one. I still got it. Stupid. There. Two little smacks with the gun there. there is, that's impossible to avoid. Oh, yeah, good, and I wasted a bullet. Perfect. Okay, I think I hit that time. Uh, now I'm not sure what to expect, though. We got one more bullet left. Uh, that, is that the Palenque attack? I don't think so. Oh, well, oh my god, one. <laughs> um, what do you What do you got? Oh, shit. That, I, I think that is the Palenque attack. Uh... Could you please come down here so I can hit you? Thank you. Ah, I missed my last bullet. Oh, that's not fair. Ah, fuck you. The bendy death beam. <laughs> fuck. Well, I think Palenque is number six out of eight, so that seems better at the very least. Ah. <sighs> Damn it! <laughs> Could be at this for a bit, yeah. but considering how fast we kind of hit this final section today, that's I'm okay with doing this fight a couple times. That's fine. Strike there. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Go for the last. Oop, ah, got, got greedy. Got greedy. Yeah, one hit on me, but not, not too bad. Of Spears. Thank you. Okay. And all right. Not bad. Only one hit. It's impressive. Okay. Da -da -da. Axe. Axe and gun. Axe and gun. To finish this out. Hopefully. Okay. So let's keep count this time. There's one. Right. Two. Ow. Three. Four. Five, I think. Oh, oh, easy. Uh oh, uh. Oh, ah, oh, we didn't get it in time. Ah, oh, damn it. And that attack. Come on. All right, I've already lost count. I think that's that must be five there. I think because that's not. I think Palenque is number six. There's Palenque. So there's six. I'm trying to kind of anticipate. Uh, <laughs> all right, uh, we've got no more bullets left, so let's just have a shield out just in case. Uh, it's 
Not even Kirby Death Beam, so that's interesting. There's seven. Oh, we're getting so close. This is stop. Stop moving. Uh, oh, what are you doing? Okay. Okay. Oh, Kirby Death Beam. Oh, come back. Come down here. There's eight. Okay. Oh, I feel like we're really close. Oh, yeah, there's the Tia attack. Okay. Please. Please stop moving around. Ah! <laughs> stop. Please. Ah! Come on. So fucking close. Oh, Kirby Death Beam. All right. Yeah! All right. Is that going to be it? Please tell me. Tell me that's it. It's the death rattle. Jeez. Oh, I hate that fight. Kind of. Okay, so uh, now though, now there's the escape sequence. I don't remember what to do here. I know we got to get to Mulbrook, but I don't remember the path. <laughs> I don't remember the path to get to Mulbrook. So we're going to take our time. We're going to be patient. I'm going to pause a lot and look at maps and shit because I don't know how to get back. So, oh, we don't have a map. Oh, we've got five minutes to do this. Are you kidding me? Ah, uh, shit. All right, uh, let's back to normal ass. Okay, at least they refilled my health for this. That's kind of them. Fucking. Of course, if they're gonna do that, that's gonna help me. Sorry. All right, we'll see where this exit takes us. Like, I don't, I don't know. I think it might just put me in the Temple of the Sun, which would be ideal. Oh, a nice rope there. Okay, clearly they're gonna put me back. Dimensional corridor? Oh, endless corridor. Fuck. Uh. I guess we'll just keep going. Excuse me. Oh, all right. Um, that's good. And I think this goes to the Temple of the Sun. That would be super rad. Oh no, mausoleum. Uh, but we can get to the Temple of the Sun from mausoleum. I think, right? <laughs> Look it up. Look it up just to be sure. Uh, no. Temple of the Sun, we need to get to Gate of Guidance, right? Yeah. All right. Uh, yeah? Yeah. Gate of Guidance. Um, actually, you know what? What am I doing? Let me just look up the escape sequence. Uh, would they... Did they give me a thing? During the escape sequence. Well, fucking... Why is the escape sequence not like a top-level page here? nobody on the internet here. Escape. Holy Grail broke. Of course it did. Endless Corridor, Mausoleum, and guide, Gate of Guidance. Okay. Okay, so I am on the right track. So, Mausoleum. I just want to be super sure about this, because I don't want to do it again. Don't want to have to do it again. Mausoleum, we came in from the corridor right on there. Gate of Guidance is A6. Really? Or no. No, 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 no. Gate of Guidance is B1. Oh, it's all the way at the top. Of course it is. 
Because of course it is. I'm pretty sure all this crumbling shit can hit me too, so um... That's gonna be fun, not getting crushed by it, I hope. But, luckily five minutes is a lot longer than it feels, so we should be okay as long as I don't really fuck up. Ah, that opens for me. Very good, thank you. Very kind of them to do that. Okay. <laughs> hmm, I didn't come from the other direction there. Had a real bad time. Okay, so this will get me out to Gate of Guidance, right? Then... Temple of the Sun is D5, A6 to D5. Oh, okay, so that's not that far. Just kind of go right and then up one. Uh, that's not gonna do it though. Go up a little further. Uh, that might have been the wrong. That's the wrong ladder. I need to go up over there. Okay, that's okay. That's okay, we can just do it again. Oh, well, nope, never mind. I do need to go the long way around. Thanks. Thanks, Lahalana. Cheeky bastard. go down from here and then over? I think I can. Yeah, maybe I better not. <laughs> maybe I... Well, okay, fuck it. Let's go. Okay, we can. Alright, there's Temple of the Sun entrance. Then we just need to get to Mulbrook. Which I'm pretty sure I remember the path to get to Mulbrook. Go down, down, down. Oh no, we're coming in this way. Uh, yeah, here we go, here we go. Just have to remember. Not used to going in through, uh, Gate of Guidance, used to porting in from Tablet. And here's Mulbrook, and we're out! Oh god, <laughs> finally. We made it, holy shit. Only took us, like, 18 hours to do a single rando here. But we did it, that's the important bit. We did it without looking at the item spoilers. Which is pretty impressive, I think, considering the last time I played this was... two-ish years ago? I mean, granted, I looked at a lot of maps and where items were and what puzzle solutions were, but yeah, I think that's... It's not really unexpected when playing Lava Lana, ever. Oh, boy. Okay, well, this was fun. This was a lot of fun. Uh, more fun than I expected it to be, honestly. There's just a couple things about it that kind of keep it from being, like, something I would just pick up on a whim again. Um, there's just too much kind of very obtuse hidden garbage to, to be, like, just a pick-up-and-play randomizer, honestly, but... I don't know. Maybe I'll do it again. Maybe I'll do it again at some point in the future. But I'm glad I did it once. Glad I did it at least once, because that was a good time. So just let the credits play out. Do whatever. Whilst we gather our thoughts and breathe. <laughs> is that is? I mean, we still had two minutes left on the escape sequence, really. But that's still kind of kind of nerve-wracking. Can we actually 
actually skip this. Okay. <laughs> it doesn't want me to skip it. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. So wow, I I'm actually gonna take a quickie peek at the uh, at the item spoiler log because uh, we never found the flare gun, which I think should have been required for Ex Chamber of Extinction. Uh, so let's see, which one was this? It's this one. Where the hell is the flare gun? Oh, it's not even listed in the item spoiler. Really? Uh, I feel like that's an... That feels like a bug that it, the flare gun isn't in this list at all. Huh. You know, I wonder... Because I didn't see a specific option for this, but I wonder if this was strictly the stuff you needed to beat the game. Which is why it wasn't listed here. But that feels weird. I I feel like they shouldn't expect you to do Extinction in the dark. <laughs> that feels... That feels real bad. Oh, hey, Firetron. How you doing? See ya. Thank you. Thank you very much, very much for the GG. That was like 17 to 18 hours uh, to do this single-ass rando. Um... But I feel pretty good about it. I, I, I don't think we could have done much better, considering I was going in thoroughly out of practice, so... Feels pretty good. They don't list the flare gun here. That's so bizarre to me. Because I thought there was a very explicit note in the generation program for this that said, don't require a dark chamber of extinction, but maybe I fucked up. Maybe I didn't turn that option on. <laughs> that would be kind of wild. Let me pull it up again, actually. Um, now I'm real curious. Now I'm real curious to see what it does. Uh, where the hell even is it? Oh, right, it's a Java thing. Yuck. Uh, there it is. I feel like that would have been a thing. Yeah, require flare gun for chamber of extinction. That was checked. So I don't understand why it's not even in the, the item log. Was nothing in chamber of extinction actually required? I mean, aside from fighting Palenque, right? There's nothing listed in the item spoiler for chamber of extinction. That's wild. So I did that whole sequence in the dark for nothing. Wild. That's that's pretty wild. Like, wow. Now I'd be real curious to watch this back in my in my bits through Chamber of Extinction, see what I actually picked up there. If it was just like garbage. I don't remember. Huh. That's pretty weird. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, there it is. Oh, no, that's still... Flare Gun still isn't in there. Interesting. I had case matching on my search here. And a map to the Chamber of Extinction is there. Yeah, there was nothing of value in Chamber of Extinction, just a coin chest. That, that's weird. That's weird to me, but yeah, I guess it's technically possible. <laughs> it's pretty weird that the first rando I've done of this uh, did that to me. That's, I don't know how to feel about that. But all right, let's, let's take a poke down our item list one more time. So we just missed two sub-weapons, the flare gun being one of them, because it's not listed on the item spoilers. Uh, we're missing the pepper, which would have led to one more item location, and the, um, the magatama, which I think would lead to one more item location. 
And then, what about these other items? Just the heatproof case, and there's one other item in here that I don't have. The treasures, maybe? Yeah, maybe the treasures. I, I don't see the treasures on here. Okay. Huh. That's pretty cool. Uh, but everything else we got... We got the double jump super late. That was not... That didn't make me very happy. I guess we're just missing the shurikens and, and the flare gun for sub-weapons. <laughs> Other than that, it's pretty much just 100%. Phew! Okay, well, I think we'll call that good, then. We will call that good. We will wrap the rando there. I'm surprised we finished it, but I'm super happy we did. Um... I guess I'll keep it in mind to do it again at some point. <laughs> Not for a while, probably, but I don't know. It was, it was fun. It was a lot of fun to do it. So I guess we'll call it there for today. We wrapped kind of early. I was expecting to go another like, three or four hours. Um, but I'm kind of glad we wrapped early. So that's neat. So that'll do it for today. Uh, next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CST. Uh, Sunday long plays. We're going to keep going on Overload. We've got a good set of the DLC challenge levels to do yet. Um, that's going to be a lot of fun. I do like Overload quite a bit. And then Monday, 7 p.m. CST, we'll be back on Spelunky 2, since we continue to make progress despite our best efforts. All right, that'll do it for today. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.